Him as Jay Mafia put on last showdown. I mean, yeah, it was just unbelievable how dominant he was in the last tournament, man. It was rare that somebody was even able to make him bleed, you know, or make him peel, I guess, because he's a banana, you know. <laughs> um, I, I think the only, the person that came by far the closest was Fallsy, also on the banana guard. Outside of that, I don't think there was anybody that was even that close. Not yet, that is true. So we'll see uh, if Bow Wow has uh, what it takes, man, to at least take a game off Jay Mafia, but maybe even make a huge upset uh, on the former winner of uh, Swifty Showdown. Jay Mafia versus Bow Wow. I definitely ran into Bow Wow a lot back in the beta. Yeah, he was one of those just online demons, man. He, yeah, he was a ladder monster, I'm not going to lie. Absolutely. That was what he was known for. And he, I do know when I when I hosted uh, two offline tournaments back in the beta days as well, he was there, showed up, and he was a, a good guy. So I'm grateful. Uh, I actually, he didn't even know about the tournament, but I ran into him on ladder earlier today. And he popped in chat, and I said, yo, pop in the tournament. And he signed <laughs> up right on the spot. So, and now... I mean, take a beat, beating Mohawk, man, is not easy. So very impressive. And we are hopping right into game one on Trophy's Edge. J-Mafia on the Banana Guard. And Bow Wow on the Aria. Show them what we got. All right, let's see. Go. I, I will say I'm interested to see if Arya can get any of the uh, the Airwalker combos. Um, I was a victim to those earlier today, and it does take a good read for it to actually work, but that will be a way he can get the early kill. Obviously, Banana Guard all it takes is an up-air up special. Um, That's true. But Arya... Yeah, could definitely, yeah, he could stack up as much as possible with Jab. Just like right here. Here we go, good start so far. Playing a really patient too at the start of the match at least. Running away, is this death? Good dodge to not die from up air at 30. Um, off stage is gonna be really, really tough for Bow Wow, I think. Uh, Banana Guard's really good off stage. A Mafia is really good off stage. And Arya can be weak off stage. But in neutral, looking really good for Bow Wow. And dangerous, barely missing oh the down goodness. air right now. Jay Ma right there, Jay Mafia. Definitely put himself in a questionable position right there, but Bow Wow making his way back to stage with Dagger. Jay Mafia catching the Sayer, coming back. Up there's not going to be enough to do it right here. Trying to get the neutral ground attack. But just like that, he finds the Sayer. Sayer will be the first stock coming to Jay Mafia. Not quite enough to even it up right there. Almost for Bow Wow. Oh, let's see. Is it death? It's not. <laughs> Sorry, every time Banana Guard gets an up air at 20, like, he just might die. <laughs> nah, yeah. <laughs> That's just how it is. So let's see if Bow Wow can get the finish here, man. J Mafia doing a really good job of stalling out the burnout. Getting his dodge meter right back. Getting that full jab combo tree into the side special. Getting that ground bounce. We are to just... The up air is not going to connect, but down tilt is going to find the stock on J Mafia. Yep, even stocks right now. Uh, Bow Wow, I like just the patience in neutral, man. He just is not rushing into anything, taking his time, um, and he's just got to get the right opportunity. Oh, great mix-up on the side special, and almost caught him again with another side special. Bow Wow on burnout right here. Bad spot for him. I'm out here trying to get aggressive, trying to find this elimination right here. Trying to get some up attacks and some jabs, but Bow Wow actually finds himself finding Jay Mafia. Good. Stacks up a few little bit much of damage right there. Yeah, great little combo right there from Bow Wow. I'm feeling a random side special from J Mafia coming. Uh, looking for the kill. Oh, uh, and dodge there will do it though. That side air will definitely find its elimination. They're going into burnout, but again, the kill for it is worth it every day of the week. Um, a little bit of extra credit already for J Mafia. Bow Wow is going to need to cut off the bleeding soon if he wants a chance. Down there into up air is going to connect right here. Oh, got Dagger's the dagger. Now in. Ooh, ooh, but dagger into up special is no longer true anymore. Yeah, which is a huge change, huge nerf to Arya. Um, and J Mafia with a big lead right now. Up till not quite going to do it, but another one will. Uh, 
Fowl can get the kill. He has a chance. Got a jab. Up special. Sare. Going to last stock. Let's Got see Bow Wow. He's going to have to stack up some type of damage right here. Oh. J Mafia dodging into dagger, but the aerial size special. I think that was just some big brain plays from J Mafia right there, man. Intentionally, he walked into the dagger and then said, I know you're going to teleport to this and hit him with the side special. Just really, really well done from J Mafia. Very smart coming in for J Mafia right there. Oh, Absolutely. Sorry. Uh, Moises, can y'all actually wait so we can throw you guys on stream after? I'd appreciate it. After the set, we can go right to you guys. That would be perfect. Yeah. All right, going right into game two, running it back, same stage. I gotta say, I'm just impressed that Bow Wow like actually survived to a decent percent every stock. Uh, really good sign that not getting an early up air to up special for J Mafia. So he's at least giving himself a chance. Playing really patient and neutral, man. Running all the way away. And J Mafia though, is just seems to have the read on all these engages. Chasing him down. I feel like if Bow Wow does continue to play it the way he played it, apply some little more damage, continue to play his life, that he can definitely find a point on the set right here. Absolutely. Great Nair from Banana Guard right there. Great stall as well into the down air to avoid the down tilt. Going for up airs. Sharkin. Sair. Not quite enough at 90%. Getting the dagger. Ooh, dodging the dagger. Great timing from J Mafia. And hitting the side special as well, taking that first stock. Jab into dagger. Oh, waiting out the side special. Let's see what kind of combo we can get. Oh, dagger oh, expired. The worst possible time right there. Really unfortunate for Bow Wow. Um, not a bad spot though. Still racking up a good amount of damage. Oh my goodness, that jump. Oh, that dodge jump near into the stair. Beautiful from J Mafia. What a conversion to get the early kill. And it is not looking good for Bow Wow right now. J Mafia just stalling in the blast zone. All right, Bow Wow at least gets the kill. It's not quite over yet, but a whole stock lead for J Mafia. And we are playing a patient. J Mafia is platform camping right now. Uh, I think a little bit in response to Bow Wow has been playing a lot of the game very passive, running away. Um, so I think that's a response from J Mafia saying, hey, I can do it too. Poor burnout. Or poor dodge meter usage for Bow Wow. About to cost him his life. Maybe not, but a good amount of damage. Especially with these two characters, you do not want to be in any type of burnout situation. But the double aerial side special is going to do it. J Mafia taking game two. And that is a 2 0 for J Mafia, continuing his absolute dominance, man. I don't know if anybody is going to be able to, uh, to stop him. At this point, it is just, he's looking almost unbeatable at this point. But we will see. There's still plenty more games to be played. Uh, 